Hi guys, welcome to the next episode of Focus on Sounds here at Regent Sounds. And this week we're showing you the American Professional Telly. This, this particular one is one of the ash bodied versions. There's both ash and alder offered in this range. Both uh, rosewood and maple fingerboards as well. This particular one has the maple neck, nice deep modern C fill. Also has nine and a half inch radius, narrow tall frets. And what's nice about this model as well is they've got rid of all of the kind of thick lacquer on the back, had a nice satin feel neck, and then a gloss fingerboard. So the, with, the, with a lot of kind of maple necks, I like the glossy feel under my fingers, but sometimes having no lacquer on it just makes it a lot quicker feeling, as it were. It was also to note on this particular guitar are the pickups on this. So on this, they're very unique to this guitar. They were designed by Tim Shaw, known as the V-Mod pickups and all the actual magnets are completely different to each other. So they're different Alnico values. As well as the pickups, another unique feature to this guitar is the actual ashtray. Now, my, a lot of people do find it comfortable, but a lot of people find it uncomfortable. So what Fender have done is they've actually shaved off a part here. They've made it slightly wider as well. So it's a little bit different feeling, but it feels quite traditional. It's not like having a six saddle on a telly. Speaking of saddles, they've got three compensated bra saddles here. So it's perfectly intonatable and it's a wonderful feeling of playing guitar. But let's see what it actually sounds like. Today we're running through a Cornell Romany 12. This is a British, British made amplifier and it really sounds really killer. Also, we're making it up with an SEV7 microphone. And for the dirt, we're using a Nobles ODR1, which is sounding absolutely massive i love this little thing and it doesn't break the bank as well it's really cool <laughs> So now you've heard a few of the sounds this guitar can produce. This guitar is a wonderful, wonderful instrument. Made for the professional in mind, it is great. You could take this on the road and it would definitely, definitely hold its weight. It's a very stable instrument. It stays in tune very, very well. And it's been a nice evolution of what the American standard has become. Obviously, it's now known as the American Professional Series, but it's definitely a nice evolution of the guitar. It's got the traditional kind of aesthetics and feels, but it's also got a lot of modern attributes. So it's very, very well loved guitar here at Regent Sounds. And uh, if you haven't visited us already, we're at 4 Down Mark Street, so please feel free to come down at any point in time. If you can't, feel free to view, look at our website, uh, regentsounds.com. Also, we're very, very active on social media. All the links should appear below me now. And uh, if you guys have liked this video or any of the previous ones, please feel to like, subscribe and comment. And um, please comment also on what, guitar, what videos you'd like to see, what guitars you'd like to hear, any pedals, amps, any suggestions at all are always welcome here. And thank you very much for watching this episode. And
think of it, Jack. Think of it logically. Once the bus has gone to be fair. Yeah. So think about it logically. <laughs> now we've heard how it sounds. We really love this guitar. It's, a ni it's been a nice evolution of what the American standard is, even though it's not known as the American standard anymore. It's, it's American professional. professional. It's designed for the professional in mind, studio uh, studios, or even in pub gigs, anything. This is a killer, a killer instrument. Uh, this is a great standard of what America. Yeah, the American. This is a great so example of where for the bar.